$159. Y'all. Hey y'all, welcome to Vlogmas Day 3. So today we are doing a little bit of a vlog style sit down video. I am going to be talking about handbags that are under a thousand dollars that I think you should consider adding to your collection. Some of these bags I do not have. A lot of them I don't have. Um, some of the bags I do know, you know, some of my girlfriends have them or I've seen them talked about. So yeah, we're just going to get right into it. But if you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any of the Vlogmas videos. Make sure your notifications are on because girl, we are posting every day until Christmas. So without further ado, let's get into the bag. So I have my laptop and my cell phone here because I want to just be able to look at the bags while I'm talking to you all. The first bag that I want to talk about is the GG Marmont Mini Bucket Bag. Now this bag comes in black and also a white color. It almost looks a little bit off-white. Now this bag is $980. Two of my girlfriends have this bag. So my best friend Brandy has this bag and my homegirl Mika has it. Brandy has it in black, Mika has it in white. Both of them love this bag. This is definitely a bag that I feel as though I should add to my collection. Um, it's not something I need right away, but I do think it's super duper cute. I love that it is a bucket style. Bucket style is one of the bags I don't really have. Well, I have my little Burberry like bucket bag, but other than that, I don't have like a leather bucket bag style handbag. So that is definitely one that I want to consider adding to my collection down the road. Not a big, big rush, but definitely one I want to consider. But they have it in black and white on the Gucci website. You may be able to find it in other colors, you know, if you buy it pre-loved, because I've seen it in other colors. But if you are just looking on the Gucci website, those are the options you have. The next particular bag from Gucci that I want to talk about is the Ophidia GG mini bag. So this particular bag is $920. It's super tiny, but it's super cute. Now y'all, I saw this bag a few months back. I want to say it was like, um, I want to say it was like early spring. Yeah, early spring I stopped in Gucci. I think I was shopping for um, something for my husband or something like that. And I saw this bag. Now, it's tiny, but it's super duper cute. It's that Ophidia print. It has that red and green detail. I saw someone on my Instagram that I follow with this bag. And I was just like, girl, I kind of want that bag. <laughs> it's not something I need, right? But it's something that I definitely feel for $920, it would be worth it. It's super duper cute. Um, Bags under $1,000 are not so easy to find these days. With all these price increases, y'all already know. There's not a bunch of bags that you're going to just get that's under $1,000. Even with tax, some of these bags may still be under $1,000. You're just not going to find that that much these days. So these two bags from Gucci are definitely ones you should consider because I really, really love them. Now let's kind of work our way on over to Prada. So... I could pull out my bag, but I'm just going to pop up pictures because it's just easier. Um, there are, are two bags from Prada that are under $1,000 that I definitely do recommend. The first one is the Prada Nylon 2000 bag. Now, y'all, I have the 2005 version. The 2000 version is a little bit cheaper, so it comes in at $950, and it's just that full nylon. They do have the 2005 version, which is $995, and that one has the leather handle. So my pink one that I currently own does have that leather handle, so it's the 2005 version. I love that bag. My best friend Brandy bought that bag for her birthday in Atlanta, the black one with the leather handle, so the 2005 version, and she's loved that bag so much. When I carried my pink one in Vegas, I was just reminded of like, how much I could fit inside the bag. I really felt like, I almost thought I couldn't fit as much in there, so I didn't really grab it as much, but man, when I put all my stuff in there for Vegas, I was stuffing all kind of stuff in the bag, and it worked just fine. So, 
those are two bags from Prada under a thousand dollars that you could consider there's one other option but it's not a handbag it's a wristlet these are sometimes hard to find on the website I know Benita Brewington, she did a review on hers and she's shown how she's like added a strap to it. Um, yeah, so on the website it is coming up as, it says $4.95. I thought it was like $5.25. Is this one different? Let me see. Oh uh, yeah, this one says out of stock. I believe they're like $5.25. This one on the site says $4.95, but it is out of stock. Um, I saw it in Vegas in a pink color and I really, really liked it. It was a very, very faint light pink, a little bit different from the one I currently own, but it was really, really cute. So if you're not trying to get an actual bag and you're okay with a pouch and you want to just add a strap to it, add a little top handle, I'm sure you can find all that stuff right on Amazon. That's definitely an option to consider. Um, but overall, if you want more of a handbag that's actually a bag, the Prada nylon bag is a good option. Now let me go over to my phone because I had put down a list of bags that I wanted to talk about and I'm like starting to forget. Oh yes, so there is a bag from Ferragamo. Let me go to Ferragamo's website. Now this particular bag, I haven't seen a lot of people talk about this and not a lot of people talk about Ferragamo handbags, but I saw one that had a top handle that's like a mini bag and I was like, oh, this is super duper cute. So it's coming in at about $995, so definitely under our $1,000 mark. With tax, you're going to go over that, but y'all already know how that goes. So this is the Gansini mini bag. So this is available in black, a couple different prints, and also in red. This bag does appear to be available on the website. It's a calf leather and it's made in Italy. Y'all, this bag is very, very cute. It's definitely an evening bag. So if you are looking for something that's going to be more of a, you know, going out bag, date night, girls night, things like that, a cute lunch date. That's what this particular bag is going to be good for. Um, in the printed styles, let me just see if it's more expensive. I'm curious. I don't care for the print. <laughs> yeah, so the prints are a little bit more expensive at $1,090 for one. It's like a floral print. And then, yeah, the other one also. So both of those are $1,090. So a little less than $100 more for a print, but I don't really care for that. The black, if I were shopping and I needed to secure something under $1,000, this one would be really, really cute. So the next one is from Alexander Wang. Um, this one is definitely well under the $1,000 price point. Now this particular bag comes in different colors, it comes in different styles, you can get it in leather, suede. So I'm talking about the Alexander Wang Ryan bag. So the Ryan bag is like this cute little top handle, it's like a satchel style bag. Um, super duper cute. Uh, let's see here. So the black leather is showing up as $550. These you can often catch on sale. Yeah, it gives me like a hobo pouch uh, style. It's definitely uh, different sizes because this one looks a little bit bigger than some of the others I've saw. But I think the other ones I saw were a little less expensive. So, well, it says small. You know what? I think it's if it's the different material is why the price is different. So, I'm looking at one on Essence. This one is satin. Yeah, so the different like prints. Are gonna get you the different prices so if you want leather if you want the satin you can save a little bit of money but I think this bag is super cute this is another bag that I would genuinely add to my collection I don't have an immediate need for it but I would still consider adding it because it's super duper cute and again it'll go with several different things I would say you can't dress this bag up with a gown or anything but definitely for like your day-to-day -day wear if you're just getting cute jeans a nice blouse and you're going out to dinner going out with your girls yeah, this bag could definitely work for you. So we're moving on to another luxury brand. This particular bag I want to talk about next is coming from Balenciaga and this is their bucket bag. Now I do see several different prices. I see $9.50, $9.95. It could be just depending on if it's leather or if it's a nylon material. This bag is super duper cute. Again, another bucket style bag. I'm really loving bucket style handbags. Now they can't be dressed up as much depending on the material. So like 
like the one I'm looking at, I think this one is nylon. Yeah, so I'm looking at a nylon one. So this one I wouldn't dress up too much because of the style of it, even with just carrying it top handle because it has a top handle strap. I feel like it's gonna dress down some of your looks. So to me, this is gonna be one you would get for more like casual occasions. There is a leather version, let me find it. Let's see what the leather version. This one's nylon. For some reason right now I'm finding all of the uh, buck nylon versions. Let me go ahead and search leather bucket bag and see what I get. Because I know there's leather bucket bag options. Okay. So here's a beige one and this one is actually on. Okay, so this one's on sale. So this one in the light beige or in a brown color or black or no, not black, black is not on sale. So the beige and the brown color are both on sale for $759, y'all, that's a steal. Um, it does show that they still have some available. This is a calfskin leather, made in Italy. This is super cute, $759, y'all, that is so cute. I might have to send this to my best friend because this is up her alley like i'm not a big like tans and nudes handbag kind of girl i love a good black handbag or maybe like a pop of color but this is cute y'all like this cute for 759 dollars that is really really cute let's move on to some bags i saw from versace now these bags are actually on sale they're on the essence website now they do have several different options i'm just gonna kind of call out the options that <laughs> i would actually consider buying so let's go ahead and filter for versace i've seen a few that i was like hmm now this is just the first markdown i think for essence so i think it's like the 40 to 50 percent off but they're probably going to increase this a little bit so the first bag that i would definitely consider adding to my collection it is so cute it is the black mini la greca signature bag the bag was originally 775 dollars it's now on sale for 558 dollars i'm going to tell y'all right now if essence does another markdown because i did check versace's site they have started their sales but um i didn't see any of these bags this bag is so cute i love so it has like a little bit of a top handle style to it but it also has a chain let me see if it's detachable it's detachable y'all this is very very cute yeah yeah let me let me not rant and rave about it too much before y'all go get it i'm definitely gonna keep my eye out on this i'm gonna sign up to just keep up with the sales because if they go down on this one baby i'm not gonna have to get me this this is cute let it go down to like 400 300 baby I'm gonna have that bag. Okay, so the next one that I really like, this one is a shoulder bag. It was originally $1,195. It's the Black La Greca Signature Shoulder Bag. Um, this one is on sale for $884. This is really cute. It has a detachable strap as well, and it has a little top handle too. This is very cute. I'm telling you now, if you are shopping for a luxury handbag and you just don't have a large budget, Go on here and check this out. Go to Essence. Go look at these Versace bags. These are super duper cute. They have a lot of Versace stuff on sale. I see like sunglasses, card holders. They have a ton of stuff. Let me see. This is one other bag that I really, really like. It only shows one being left. So it was originally $975, so still under our thousand price point. This one is on sale for $702. This is more of a hobo style. They're calling it a sh shoulder bag, but to me it gives a hobo style um, to it. Brown and black. This is cute. Very, very cute. Okay. So get on essence see what you can find they have some cute options they have other handbags as well so just go on there and filter versace under the sales section because you can see them all these are cute but no that little first mini one y'all i got my eye on that one i'm gonna look at my list and see if there were any other bags that i wanted to mention off the top of my head i don't have any others that i really wanted to talk about i kind of went over all the ones to me 
that are super cute yeah i think i've kind of touched on all the ones that i like because again i wanted to focus more on bags um obviously there's clutches and things like that you can get under a thousand dollars but to me if you want a handbag we need to stick with the handbag so maybe i'll do another video on like um like pouches and wristlets and things that you could really turn into a handbag but for today i wanted to just focus on what is actually a handbag what is actually under that thousand dollar price point there are tons of other bags so the ones i share today are just some okay so don't get in here and be like well you didn't show y'all i'm just showing you all some of the items I've seen. Obviously, there is much more out there. Do your research. If you are thinking like, I can't get a bag under $1,000, I am here to say you can get a bag for under $1,000 and be happy with it. So do, do not think that, you know, because of all these price increases, you may not be able to get a Chanel or a Louis bag, okay? But you can definitely get some bags from some other brands. And again, there are some brands I didn't mention. I didn't even go look at Celine's website. So there's tons of options that you can consider. Definitely do your research before just kind of tossing it up and thinking you can't get something because, oh, it's a lot more expensive. I'm here to say you can probably get some nice handbags under $1,000 that I have not mentioned today. But yeah, so that just wraps up this video. I hope you all enjoyed this like vlog style sit down video. Um, if you all really enjoy this, I plan to continue to do it throughout Vlogmas. But if you really enjoy it, I may consider doing this for some of my videos outside of December because this was really chill. You know, I could have my computer, my phone, very, very chill vibes. I enjoyed that. So if you all enjoyed this video, let me know down in the comments so I can keep them coming. I really do appreciate all of your love and support. This video is wrapped up. So Vlogmas Day 3 is a wrap. I thank you all for your support. Please do not forget to like this video. Comment down below any bags you're on the hunt for right now. Subscribe to my channel and share this video with your family and friends. I'll see you all in my next one.